It's time once again when the Life Share Blood Bus rolls onto campus and donor recruiter Tootsie Fournette is here for one thing. We love to come and get some of that good cowboy blood. Life Share, a nonprofit independent community blood center, uses recruiters like Tootsie to get donors pumping. She was so into it, she even recruited while she sat down with us. Want to come donate blood? Wanting, Wanting to, to know, know more, I went, went to LifeShare's Life website. website. After, After looking into information concerning donation centers, I found that Lake Charles was home to such a center. Good news for Southwest Louisiana, since according to Fortinet, the blood demand has been high since Rita hit. The supplies are low, but there are some incentives to donate. The best incentive is that you're saving somebody's life. I mean, you cannot give anything greater than the gift of life, which is donating blood. You can't manufacture blood. It has to be from, from a person to give it. We do give t-shirts as a thank you, and we also have a point system now in which you accumulate points and you go to an online store and you can uh, buy. After our conversation, I wanted to show the viewers what a typical blood donation looked like. You can also go online to see a step-by-step -step pictogram at LifeShare's website. First, I filled out an information form. Then, a blood sample was taken. Don't worry, it only stings a little. This, along with some confidential questions, are to keep possible hazardous blood donations from taking place. After finding the right vein and some solution to numb the pain, the needle was inserted. I was told what to do if I felt lightheaded, and the nurses kept a constant eye on both my consciousness and my blood flow. This blood sample, according to Fournette, could be used in several ways. One unit of blood can save up to three people's lives. Uh, red blood cells are, are for people that, um, you know, when your iron is low, the plasma is used for um, burn victims a lot, and uh, platelets are used for cancer patients and heart patients. The pain was minimal, and the procedure went smoothly. If this blood was used to save someone's life, then it seems like the benefits far outweigh the cost. For Inside McNeese, I'm Sean Herndon.